Office R&D is a co-working management solution that helps workspaces grow by automating operations, maximizing productivity, and improving your member experience. It's Mike from Office R&D, and I'm going to show you what your day can look like using our platform to manage your space. Let's take a look. The day starts in the administrator dashboard, where you will see a list of some of the key metrics at your space, like occupancy, invoices, revenue, memberships, and more. You can click into each of these areas for further reports and insight into these metrics to help make better decisions about your space. The Locations tab in the middle allows you to easily switch between information at a specific location or view all location data at once. On the top right, we have the quick actions. The first one is Quick Add, which will let you immediately create new companies, members, fees, and more from anywhere within the software. Next, we have our product notes and updates. After that is support information. And finally, click the App menu button to get links to all of your member-facing apps, including the Members Portal and Public-Facing Calendars. Across the left side of the screen, you can see the blue Main Menu Navigation Bar. These icons will link to the different core sections within Office R&D. Now that we've reviewed the dashboard, let's jump into the CRM aspect of the software. Click on the Community section under the Dashboard icon. The Office R&D Community section manages all of your customer-related data and keeps your member and company data in one place so it is easily accessible by you and your staff. Let's walk through a scenario in which a new member wants to sign up for a desk at your space. In order to add a brand new member into the system, you can select Add Member and will be presented with a form to fill out the relevant information about this person. Enter in a name, email, and location and you can create this member within the system. Once this member is created, you will be launched into the profile page for a new member, Sarah, and can manage her key account information. Now that Sarah has been added into the system, you can apply a membership to her account so that we can charge her on a reoccurring basis. Click on the Add Membership box and you will be presented with some customizable membership options. Select the plan you want to apply to Sarah. If you want to offer Sarah a special discount, you can manually change the price of a membership or use one of the pre-made discounts that have been created. Let's also set up a deposit that Sarah must pay. If we do not have an end date, the membership will continue on in perpetuity until canceled. Click Add when you are ready. Once the membership has been applied, we can see that Sarah's status has now been moved to active and can see the associated credits that have been added to her account. We can also see the deposit that we created earlier has been listed as a one-off fee in her account. By default, Sarah would be charged on our next monthly bill run, which is on the 1st, but we are going to raise an invoice for a prorated amount so that Sarah can pay it when she first logs in. Scroll down to the invoice section and click on Add Invoice. The system will collect all of the memberships and one-off fees to create the invoice for the member. You can see a preview of what the invoice will look like for the customer and make adjustments as needed. When you are ready, click Add to add the invoice into the customer account or click Add and Send to also send them a notification email. Let's just add that invoice into the customer's account. Now that Sarah has been configured correctly in the back end, the next step is to invite her into the members portal so she can see her invoice and pay her bill. To invite Sarah, navigate to the Access section of the member profile and click on Enable. This will send Sarah an invitation into the members portal so that she can log in. Now that we have set up a membership from the operator side, Let's take a look at the experience from Sarah's view so you can understand what your members will see when joining your space. After we invite Sarah to the portal, she has sent a branded email welcoming her into the space. As a member, Sarah will click on the link to activate her token and join the space. Make sure your members accept this within 24 hours or you will need to resend a portal invitation. After Sarah accepts the invitation, she is directed to the branded member portal. The Member Portal is a white-labeled application on desktop and mobile that will allow your community to interact with your space. When a member signs in for the first time, they will be asked to review and sign the required terms and conditions for membership to the space. Members will also be presented with a welcome wizard where they can fill out a bio, add their picture, and connect some of their social accounts. After your members log into the portal, they will be presented with a dashboard where they can see upcoming bookings, invoices they need to pay, how-to guides, submit tickets, and more. A social feed allows operators to post important space messages, event information, and other activities, and members of the community can respond and comment. Sarah sees her invoice that we have created earlier and is able to click on it, download a PDF copy, and pay with a credit card or bank transfer. 
Office R&D supports a variety of payment integrations that you can connect with, and it is easy for your customers to manage their billing information. Now that Sarah has paid her invoice, she wants to book a meeting room for a meeting with a client. Navigating to the Members Portal Meeting Room section, she can easily view a variety of resources at the space and select the one she wants to book, either paying by credits or the cash amount of the room. Extra services can also be purchased on top of the meeting room booking and the charge will be added to the monthly invoice. If Sarah wants to search the community, she can look at the member directory and search by skill to connect with other members on a variety of social platforms. She can even message them directly through Office R&D. Lastly, Sarah needs to purchase a parking pass for the new space. To do this, she can navigate to the shop of the members portal and purchase the pass on her own, triggering an email to the space operators. These are just a couple examples of tasks members can perform within the members portal, and the portal can always be further customized to match your brand colors, space features, and amenities. Office R&D also provides a mobile app that allows your members to interact with the space and book resources from their phones. The R&D Connect app is available on both iOS and Android, but can also be white labeled to match your brand image. As an operator, you also have the ability to display public calendars and sign up links from your portal to help automate membership and meeting room bookings within your space. This will allow a public guests to view your services online, sign up, enter credit card information, and purchase a room. As an administrator, your team would get a notification and could take necessary procedures to welcome the guest into your space. Now that we've reviewed the member's experience, let's jump back over to the admin portal. Remember, you can always log in to Office R&D from our website or at app.officerd.com. We have just reviewed the sign-up and billing experience for one person, but Office R&D will be managing all of your members, companies, and memberships within the space each month. Click on the billing section to get an overview of all the invoices that have been sent from your space. Next, click on invoice to see the specific invoices that have been sent out for that month. Every single month, Office R&D helps you issue your invoices automatically. Each invoice will pull from the member's information and all of their additional purchases. We will then send the invoices to your members on the billing date and charge them. If integrated with accounting software, Office R&D completes the whole payment and accounting cycle by marking the invoices paid in QuickBooks Online or Xero. Next, click on the section below Invoices called Plans to manage your default plans within the space. The plan section allows you to create a variety of reoccurring memberships and one-off products to apply to your members. You can customize these plans to match the offerings at your space. You are able to adjust pricing, descriptions, booking credits, portal access, and much more from the plan section. Now that we have taken a look at invoicing and plans in the billing section, let's jump over into the space section. The space module allows you to manage your physical space and keep track of real-time availability of your offices and desk. You can jump into your floor plan to see all of the desks and offices that are occupied and assign new members to resources when they sign up. We also keep inventory of your meeting rooms, private offices, and desks so you can easily track who they are assigned to and the specific details. Office R&D can also manage your meeting rooms and help you keep control of your bookable resources. The calendar section allows your administrators to easily book rooms and other resources on behalf of your members. Operators can also use our meeting room tablet app called R&D Rooms outside your meeting rooms to make sure the right people are in the right rooms and to help prevent double bookings. Click on the report section on the blue navigation bar to keep track of your business performance, forecast, and make educated decisions about your space. There are a variety of reports that can be easily downloaded or exported via API if you want to dive into the data further. Finally, let's take a look at settings. This section is used during the onboarding process to configure core aspects of your space, like billing settings, integrations, and member portal customization. You will work with an onboarding specialist to custom tailor these settings for your organization. For now, let's take a closer look into the integrations. These are the core apps and tools we connect with to charge your members and automate processes at your space. Office R&D acts as the mothership for all information going into these apps, controlling accounting information, payment systems, printing, Wi-Fi, door access control, CRM, and more. Many of our customers use Stripe to charge credit cards and bank transfers at their space. To use a payment gateway, sign up for the processor online and then connect it with your bank account. Once you have done this, 
you can easily connect the service through our integration page. For example, to connect Stripe, click Add from the integrations page and select the locations you want to connect to. After this, select Connect in the integration section and sign into your Stripe account. Once this is completed, you will be able to charge customers for memberships and fees and public users can start buying their services online. Billing and payment settings will be further configured during the onboarding process, but this should get you started. This was a quick look at using the Office RE platform. Once you have things set up on the web, make sure you download our mobile app to try out your member experience on the phone. Now that you know the basics, feel free to dive right in and get started. If you ever need any help with the system, make sure to reach out to our support or chat with us on our website. If you don't have Office RD yet, you can use the link below this video to get started. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you back.